Welcome to this episode of Mommy Sea Star. Today is July 18th, 2021. And many of us are not able to go to the mass today because of lockdowns in various parts of the world. So today we're going to do the Kyrie, the Gloria, and read the readings for today's mass. I cut down the thing. Cut down the puzzle. Oh my. Let's pray, okay? In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Oh, I cut down this too. Oh, my. Let's read the readings for today first. Oh, yes, thank you. Come here and listen to the readings. <clears throat> I need to cut down the course. Very often the format is Old Testament and a New Testament reading from St. Paul or St. Peter, the life of the church, and then the gospel. A reading from the book of Jeremiah, chapter 23, verses 1 through 16. Disaster for the shepherds who lose and scatter the sheep of my pasture, Yahweh declares. This, therefore, is what Yahweh, God of Israel, says about the shepherds who shepherd my people. You have scattered my flock. You have driven them away and have not taken care of them. Right. I shall take care of you and your misdeeds, Yahweh declares. But the remnant of my flock I myself shall gather from all the countries where I have driven them and bring them back to their folds. They will be fruitful and increase in numbers. For them I shall raise up shepherds to shepherd them and pasture them. 
No fear, no terror for them anymore. Not one shall be lost, Yahweh declares. Look, the days are coming, Yahweh declares, when I shall raise an upright branch for David. He will reign as king and be wise, doing what is just and upright in the country. In his days, Judah will triumph and Israel will live in safety. And this is the name he will be called. Yahweh is our saving justice. So, look, the days are coming, Yahweh declares, when people will no longer say, as Yahweh lives who brought the Israelites out of Egypt, but as Yahweh lives who led back and brought home the offspring of the house of Israel from the land of the north and all the countries to which he had driven them to live on their own soil. On the prophets, my heart is broken within me. I tremble in all my bones. I am like a drunken man, like a man overcome with wine because of Yahweh and his holy words. For the country is full of adulterers. Yes, because of a curse, the country is in mourning and the pasturage in the desert has dried up. They are prompt to do wrong, make no effort to do right. Yes, even prophet and priest are godless. And I have detected their wickedness in my own house, Yahweh declares. Because of this, their way will prove treacherous going for them. In the darkness where they are driven, there they will fall. For I will bring disaster on them. When the year of punishing them comes, Yahweh declares. In the prophets of Samaria, I have seen insanity. They prophesy in the name of Baal and led my people Israel astray. But the prophets of Jerusalem, I have seen something horrible, adultery, persistent lying, such abetting of the wicked that no one renounces his wickedness. To me, they are all like Sodom and its inhabitants are like Gomorrah. So this is what Yahweh Sabaoth says about the prophets. Now I shall give them wormwood to eat and make them drink poisoned water. Since from the prophets of Jerusalem, godlessness has spread throughout the land. Yahweh Sabaoth says this, Do not listen to what those prophets prophesy to you. They are deluding you and not what comes from they are they are deluding you. They retail visions of their own and not what comes from Yahweh's mouth. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. I'll make a part B for this for this video.